Andreas and in Gemalto M2M, I'm in charge of the wireless modules portfolio and that also includes automotive products. In our company, automotive started in 1995 when a German car maker approached us and asked if we could uh, build connectivity into a car line. From that small foundation, uh, automotive has grown into what is uh, the M2M industry's largest vertical and the core focus of our company. Infotainment is what will change the user experience in the car and infotainment is what is going to drive connectivity into cars. While infotainment was starting with telephony in the past and then later on uh, real-time navigation services were added where you could react to changing traffic patterns on the streets or provide location-based services when you arrive at, at your target and you want to look for a nearby restaurant for instance, uh, infotainment will change the way we, we interact with the car and with the traffic. And uh, we are the first company to launch LTE modules commercially in cars. So the benefit of LTE is twofold. On one hand side, you have very, very big data pipes into the car now. And on the other hand side, you have a very low latency, which means you get an immediate reaction to any kind of activity that you trigger in the car. So when we were doing our first drive tests with our LTE modules in commercial networks on, on a German autobahn at 200 km per hour, we could consistently see more than 10 megabit of downlink speed in the car and we had peaks of 60 megabit per second. Now imagine what you can do with all that bandwidth in the car. I'm thinking about the wireless hotspot, media streaming, be it video, be it, uh, be it audio, uh, application download. Um, so the, the overall driver experience in the car will completely change in the future. Another trend in the automotive vertical is uh, the use of NFC car keys. NFC is a technology that is used in smartphones today. So if you use your smartphone to identify yourself with a car, uh, that means you can, for example, if you rent a car, you can store the settings of your car on your, on your NFC with your NFC identity. So the next time you rent a car from the same rental company, you can reapply those settings. So that means the mirror, front mirror, rear mirror, the seat position and the radio station will be the same as in your previous car. But it, of course, it is of paramount importance that all this type of communication with the car, with the driver, between the cars is totally secured. And uh, Gemalto, as the leader in digital security, has all the tools and ingredients in order to uh, make this happen also for the automotive industry. Or you take it a step further and you think about a driverless car. When I was a, when, when I was a child, I was watching Knight Rider on TV, I'm sure you know it. And I was fascinated by the driverless car. So. When I was at CES earlier this year, uh, I saw exactly that where a car was parked in front of a big garage building and uh, by applying a, a button on the smartphone, you could send your car to find a free space and park itself. And you could see where it's parked and just by applying the same button, you could call it back, step into the car and drive off. I mean, automotive really, automotive of the future, think the impossible.